listen up because we're going to get into some activity right now. So the things that you should be striking because this, like Gabriel right over here, you're not going to be able to fight this guy, right? So what, what do you think he needs to strike if something happens, if he's coming up to him? Kick him. Kick him where? Kick him in the house. Kick him in the house. Kick him in the house. All right, listen, guys. All right, right over here. So those are some, some good ideas. Right over here, taking out his knee. And then also he's got his groin right here. Okay. Do any of you guys fight? Yes. Okay, let me turn it another way. Do you guys compete in the UFC? No. Okay. So you make a little ball of fist and then you're hitting somebody. And guess what happens? I might as well just punch the wall and you're going to break your hand. So what you think about is that you guys have an open hand and that you're going to be striking somebody. So if I'm striking him, guess what I'm going to strike him? Right in the groin. I'm going to punch him in the Okay? And then he uppers. So. So right here, let's stop right here. Put your arm out there. Matthew, stand up for me a second. So if I'm holding this bag, okay, look how small he is. Okay, is he gonna punch me in the face? <laughs> no. He's gonna be hitting. He's gonna be. He's gonna be hitting in that groin area. And he's also gonna be kicking in that knee area. What the coaches are gonna do? They're gonna basically hold this. He's gonna go ahead and punch. You're gonna keep open hands, and you're gonna punch as hard as you can towards the groin area. Just like you were last night. <laughs> yeah, again, harder. Now, one thing that he should be doing is what? Breathing. Breathing. Thank you, Rob. Breathing. <laughs> Breathing, and then also basically telling him to get back. Now, for law enforcement, guess what happens if we get to a situation? We basically stop police because guess what happens? It looks everybody around you. The so same exact thing for kids. If something's happening, go ahead, you hit. They stop, right? Go ahead, do it again. Again, harder. Go. And then eventually, what does that do? Gets that kind of reaction for this person to kind of get away. Other things that he has, see where my knee is. He right over here. He's going to go ahead and throw that teeth at me. Just throw that teeth, push kick. Push it. He's basically hitting that. Go. Me. Are you again? Go. Hit. Go. Come on. Punch, punch, punch. Go. Other hand. Other hand. There you go. Other hand. And see how he went out? Guess what happens if he has a ball fist? He's probably going to sprain it or break it. Yes, sir. Um, last time you came, you told us to punch you. I didn't tell you to punch right there. That's the that's I told you not to punch there because that's a ball. Oh. Okay. Yes. Thanks for listening. All right. <laughs> so what we're gonna do now is we got these coaches right here and they're gonna hold and we're just gonna have you guys strike. You guys will line up. But what I want to hear from you guys is what do you think I want to hear? Breathing. Breathing. What else? Stop. Stop. Stop dropping. Stop drop and roll. That's not his last word. Okay. Stop. 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 Stop.